Hi everyone, welcome to my crochet nook. My name's Linda and today we are on advent number 11. Yay guys, I got it right. It's 11 today. Let me just move you around. There we go. <laughs> Hope you're all well. I have, uh, excuse the attire, but I have just come back from my um, nice long walk. Uh, with Rick and uh, we've just made it back home in time before the rain started so we're on day 11 yay and it's XOXO oh yes XO kiss 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 so and we've got a nice orange burlap bag or hessian whatever you want to call it and oh 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 guys, I'm liking this. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, it's going into purples, guys. And you know, you know, no, no, that I love purple. <gasps> oh, that is gorgeous. And there is Stellina in it as well. And um, gold. And um, so I'll just get out day 10. Look at that. So there... That's ten. That's today's with the purples. And then we had, what did we have? And then we had day nine. We had this colour. So they kind of all blend together. Now, I'm in a bit of a conundrum now. So, what do you think, guys? Do you think because I've gone on to something else, I should start maybe another show? with this colours and can just continue using up to um, six, seven um, because let me just put these back in so that was number so what I'm thinking I might do guys let me just run this by you that was ten no that was ten that was nine. That was nine. Right, okay. I'm in a bit of a conundrum now what to do. Because these have gone on to the blues and the purples and the pinks, I'm not sure whether to do, um, let's see, 11, 10, 9. So, okay. So I'm on to day four and if you can see we've got the oranges and yellows and that uh, which is this colour which is day four and then we've got day five is this colour, day six is this colour as you can see, then day seven is this colour and then day eight is this and then nine uh, goes on so I'm not sure whether to just work with these colours now finish this shawl and then um, using all the colours and then because I've still got some left of uh, one, two and three and then maybe go back and finish all them so if I do all eight six, seven yeah, so if I use all eight on this shawl and get see how far I can go with this. Because I reckon this would make a nice cowl. What do you think? Let's see how I do, hey? I'm not undecided now what to do because I don't really think... I don't really think those colours will... Um, for me personally, um, I'm not sure. We'll see. I'll see when I get to it. So, I will show you number 11 again because I am... It's purple, guys! Purple! So, this is 11's and what do you think I should do? Hey? What do you think I should do? Because I don't really think those colours would blend... Hmm. That's my personal opinion. Hey, they could very well look all nice together, but I'm thinking I'll just knit up the rest of uh, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Just work them until they're all finished, and then 
go back and finish all these off so for the first eight I'll get I'll get quite a decent sized shawl with this what's left answers on a postcard please guys so thank you so much just uh, on a quick note if you like my little Santa hat this is um, a pattern from Reggie over at J Hook Crochet and as is the advent and I've actually emailed her and asked her if she's going to do another one next year because you can bet your bottom dollar I'll be buying another one if she does so I'm going to put the link to this hat it's called Gondolin Elf Hat but I made it in red and white so I could use it wear it while I'm doing my Chris, uh, masquerade advent calendar I am going to love you and leave you now I hope you all have a fabulous day and I'll see you all tomorrow. I wonder what colour we'll have tomorrow, guys. I wonder. Bye for now.